Were times hard when you were young? They were. Mm. <coughs> Did you do a bit of farm work? Oh yeah. In the springtime we had to go out spread the slits and spread manure in the And how would you spread the slits? My mother used to cut them, put potatoes and in, in the slits. Yeah. <laughs> and I never, little bits. I, I never knew how to do it, but my mother did it and mm. intended I don't know, father to know I think. But um, we spray them in the ridge. Yeah. It was a ridge, it wasn't a, it wasn't a drill. Oh, yeah. In the old, in the very beginning now it was a drill and a spade work. There's no mm. clothes until but later on. No machinery at that time, no? It was very young, we got with a plough and horse for, for drills. But before that, we <coughs> a certain men with the ridges. Ridges, I think. Ridges flat, isn't it? Scorley land, huh? You, you'd put the manure up the green. Yeah. I think you'd find we'd get seaweed as well. Yeah. And uh, spread the... The slit? The slit, no, tree in a tree in a bridge. And cover it then? Cover it in with the soil. soil yeah. And then um, after, when the, when the stalk began to appear, they mould it again, dig more, more again. And would you have much of that? Would you have a big area of that? A fair bit. A fair bit, yeah. It was hard work? It was hard work, hard work. They had to be dug out then? Yeah. Who did that? I again. My father and mother. Father and mother, my yeah. Mother used to help him. We ne I never knew how to dig, but my mother did, was a great woman after that. Mm. She'd do everything. And would you have to give them a hand to pick them up now? Oh, we had, we had to run over school to pick them. Hmm. How about hay? And save the hay too. We had to come home early. We had, home. We had time for playing much. We'd get a chance to play in the evening after we'd have finished. Hmm. How did they cut the hay that time? By side. Father. Side, side. Yeah. Father. Father and daughter, the same way. Big field? Big field, the hay and oats. And how long would it take them to cut a field? Oh, God. You'd be at it a few days, you would? I would, yeah. Did you go to the bog? I did. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing in the bog? Spitting, spitting turf and, and pushing it. Did you have any dolls? Dogs. Dolls. We you, had you time to oh, play I and... When I was very young. Is it you mean? Yeah, you were very young, yeah. Uh, I, I don't remember having trains now. <laughs> I don't remember dolls. I remember having trains along the ground. Did you have Santa Claus every Christmas? Oh yeah. yeah. That was a very big event in our time. My mother used to have lovely cakes and everything. It was lovely. And presents? Presents, yeah. Mm -hmm. When I was in Carey's, when I bought Carey's, I had to cycle up for Carey's. And my bicycle, at that time, there was no such thing as bags. You had to tie it in a string in the door passage. And my behalf up there on the break and be <laughs> all the passage on the ground. The home presents to everybody for, for Christmas or something. Like now, like, not like nowadays where it's Christmas every day, really. Oh, yeah. yeah. And cars. Cars. Any cars down there at the time? Can mean it? No cars at all. We signed six abreast from for school in town here. Six abreast. Yeah. And then, any of the neighbours have any cars? There was one in, in, that was travesty, but he had a hectic car. Hectic car. Yeah. Were there it's many no, tractors around? Ah, no. No tractors. I think Peter was the one of the first. Yeah. My husband was one of the first. I don't remember getting a tractor. Can you remember when the first tractor appeared around the place? He was the first I ever saw. The first I ever saw? Yeah. And was he hiring it, he was? No, he bought it. For the farm? He bought it for the farm. His okay. So I suppose that's what got him into the machinery, was it? Mm -hmm. That's what got him into the machinery? Well, he loved machinery. He loved the, he loved the machinery himself. Mm. And the father was against him. I remember well, he didn't want to die, die it, but he loved it. So they were tough times? They were, they were fairly well off, I think, the yeah. carpenters. They were after we were, anyway. Mm. It was, were the happy days when you were young? Well, it sounds tough, you know. Well, of course, happy, I think. Happy, you weren't uh, bored. Were you bored? Never. Never bored. Never bored. And would you meet? Well, I tell you, our house now was an unusual house. My father was <coughs> loved music, and he still had the notes and he'd play every night, every night, nearly. And then the cap players would come in with the cap players, and this tray all oh, went on the table then. I remember we'd be made to go to bed because we were going to school and we'd look, <laughs> and look in the window at them. There's a corridor outside, see, before we go to our bedroom and she keep looking at the window at the lads at the car, at the table. <laughs> car playing. Playing away. And then they turn into a dance. Daddy would start playing them and they'd go dancing. It's great. And would this be a weekend or midweek or any time? Every, every night. Nearly. Every night? Nearly every night of the week to our car playing. And was there much drink going on? No drink. No drink at all? Wouldn't we have a barrel of Guinness or...? No. No such thing as six packs that time? No, no. No. 
for a wedding. Now, we'd a wedding here. When, my, when I got married, I got, my wedding was at home. In the house? In the house. And we got um, barrels then, of course, didn't you? Know, three or four barrels then, I think. And were there many at the wedding? There was 250. It was a double wedding. And a double wedding? A double wedding. Who else got married? My brother, Tommy. Oh, OK. Mm. And where did you put the 250 people? Out in the garden. Out in the garden? Big garden outside. So, must have been, was it a fine day? Beautiful day. Would you look at? September. It was a lovely day, thank God we're lucky. And what kind of music did you have there that time? Lodin. Trouble King Lodin. The neighbour of ours was great. Lodin player. Who was that? Cordia player. What was, can you remember his name? Jimmy Cummins. Jimmy Cummins. Did they have the dance out? Yeah. Cummins the dance, dance, dance out. out. Okay, right. Yeah, yeah. So the, were most weddings held at home that time, were they? They were. But my, my sister then, when she got married five years after, ours was no hotel. They were starting to move to the hotel then, were they? Yeah, that's right, yeah. yeah that's very interesting, yeah. Mm-hmm. What kind of dances were you doing that time? Half sets. Half sets. And foot sets. <laughs> no waltzing? No, but there's no room for There was no space, okay. Right. It was when the hall started, there was yeah. waltzing, right? Fox dance. And did the hall start in your time, or was it there before you? It was there before me. Before you, yeah. When I was very young, we used to go down looking in the window, the dancing. <laughs> At the adults? There was a height outside the hall. I was looking at them in dancing. I was I was our teacher. I remember looking at dancing, watching her. Did she know you were watching? No. no. Oh, she knew. We lived beside it, not far from the dance hall, you see. Yeah. We'd walk down at night to hear the music and look at it. Would you be in trouble if, if she. No? I don't think so. I don't think so. No.